A statewide manhunt is on right now for a former Central Florida middle school teacher now suspected of murdering his ex-wife's boyfriend. Good afternoon. I'm Jim Payne. I'm Meredith McDonough. Authorities are looking for this man, Michael Friedman. He's accused of killing the victim around one this morning on Osage Court in Winter Springs. Two teenagers were also at home at the time. Lush's Bob Keelan reports that the suspect should be considered armed and dangerous. Literally, I, it sounded like somebody ran into the house. It was very loud. It was extremely loud. Neighbor Ryan Brooks described the gunshot that rattled him out of bed early this morning. When he went outside to investigate, another neighbor was already walking towards the shooting scene. There was another gentleman that was approaching the house. We heard loud screams um, from a woman. I couldn't really make out what she was saying, but um, um, they were fairly loud. Winter Springs police say this man, 63 year old Michael Friedman, stabbed his ex wife and shot and killed her boyfriend. Two teenagers who were home at the time were not injured. Now police believe Friedman may be headed back towards his home in Delray Beach, and they're concerned he may be capable of even more violence. Absolutely, there's a concern. Uh, we still think it's an isolated incident. We've done a statewide broadcast that we're looking for this guy, so we're hoping for the best. The Seminole County School District confirms Friedman taught social sciences at Markham Woods Middle from 2009 until leaving for personal reasons in 2011. A neighbor says he saw Friedman packing up his car outside his South Florida home last night. Deputies checked it again today to make sure he had not returned. That was Bob Keeling reporting. Friedman is believed to be traveling in a four door silver Hyundai Azera with a Florida tag NZ22VU. The woman suffered non life threatening cuts. Now, police have not released her name or the identity of the murder victim.